concerted party effort to run candidates or to support candidates in a non-partisan race. City Council is non-partisan race. But this year, a couple of folks got excited about these races, and they were really concerned about what's happening in our city council, as am I, I'm my dad. We've got some Democrat socialists, um, embedded Democrat socialists that are on our city council. Uh, we only really have a couple of Republicans that are on that council. And so Mike Chase, who owns Calhoun's Copper Cellar and several restaurants around town, and Randy Burleson, who owns Aubrey's, got together and decided that they were going to make an effort to try and actually put some money and support behind the city council race. So they created this scruffy city pack, and I've been to, I went to several of their meetings to kind of see what was happening, get interested in it. And they hired a campaign manager, a uh, young man, Eric Wider, Wider, um, to kind of support that effort on the city council campus. They were pretty champions. They've got some good candidates. Um, all of the Scruffy City Pack back candidates came out of the primary, but now it goes citywide. And so I think we'll have a better shot citywide than we would have had in the districts. The districts are drawn pretty tight to the, to the Democrats, to be honest. Um, but I, I, I'm not terribly optimistic that we'll pick up any seats this time, but it's a beginning. And I think it was the right thing to do because if you're really concerned about what's happening in our city, with our city council, our city government, you better get you better get concerned about it coming to the county because it's a matter of time until that movement, that city council movement that's very active in these races, and it's also the Democrat Socialists. They have targeted cities in the South, like Knoxville and like Jackson, Mississippi, and sort of mid-sized cities like that in the South to begin to make their way to turning these into Democrat socialist communities.